ones who do not know how to move pictures from their phone to their computer. First of all, you can hit Windows E to bring up an explorer. You can grab it and drag it to the side. Hit Windows E again and open another file explorer. Go to make sure, first of all, that your phone is plugged in with your USB into your PC. Here's my phone. You may have to press the on button on your phone and enter a passcode so that your phone is activated in the proper way. Then it should show up in your list somewhere here. Here's mine. I double click on it and here's my storage. Double click on that and you want to go to DCIM. You probably have this listed. If it's an Apple phone, I have no idea if it's the same. But this is a Android, Samsung Android phone. So I double click on this and here are all the folders that I have on my phone. Camera, these are separate folders where I've moved pictures into. Here's the camera. And here's a bunch of recent pictures. Now you'll notice up here on the top, this is the camera on my phone. Over here, this is my PC. So I'm going to go to my pictures folder on my computer. And I'm going to click a new folder. Down at the bottom, there's a new folder. And I'm going to name this March. 2022. Hit enter and that's created. Now I open it up. Oop. That's a friend of mine. Let's go back. Come on. Sorry. My mouse is acting up. Let's close all these. Okay. Pictures. There's March 2022. Okay, here's the empty folder. Now all I have to do is, if you don't see the pictures, you can click over here and say view. And you want large icons. So now I can see the pictures of all my doggies. And I can hit one. If I don't want this one, I skip it. I can hold down the control key and click another one to add it to the group. If I wanted all of them from here, say down to there, I could click the top one, hold down the shift key, click the last one and everyone in that area is selected. If I realize I don't want this one in the group, I can hold down the control key and click it again and it will be unselected. Now I can click and hold the mouse button down and drag these over to my computer. And you'll notice it says it's going to copy them. If I actually wanted them moved, I can click and hold them with the right mouse button. So I click and hold them with the right mouse button and when I move them now, I have a choice to copy or move. So if I move them, those pictures are going from my phone to my computer. And you'll see they're gone now. So that's all you have to do. And then you can close out your phone and you can close out your computer. And now your pictures have been moved or copied, depending on what you want, from your phone to your PC. And if you have a feature like Amazon or uh, Amazon's cloud pictures, if you pay for that, or Microsoft's OneDrive, you can 
now open that app on your PC and send those pictures up to the cloud as a copy so that if your computer goes down at some point, you will always have your pictures because they're safely protected in the cloud. Hope that helps.